Hey guys, him here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make dog food. So the things that we're going to be making today are broccoli, salad. So if your doll is a big veggie fan, we also have some little surprise fast food at the end. So stay tuned for that. Let us begin. So the first thing we're going to be making is broccoli. We're only going to be needing scissors and this dish scrubber pad so if you don't have this there are plenty of other options options like sponge you can just paint it green thermocall you can just paint it green um i don't know anything that looks like broccoli can be broccoli So this was super simple. You can put it with salad, um, I don't know, anything that you like broccoli with. So let's move on to the salad. So for making sure the salad, it's going to be a little harder than the broccoli. Since we're going to need more stuff and it's going to take more steps. So the first thing I'm going to be using is paper. I didn't have the right color that I wanted so I just used this random color and and Oh yeah, and scissors. And also, I painted this piece um, of paper um, tomato-y color because I couldn't find a perfect color for tomato, so I just painted it. So now, that's all the stuff we're going to be needing. So the first step, we're going to be painting the leaves. So let me just cut this real quick. That's a very deep, rich green. I love it. It's so
Okay, so I finished painting one side. Now I'm just going to let this dry and flip it over and paint the other side. So let's let this dry. Okay, so I let this dry and I flipped it over and painted the other side. Um, so I think I did a little better on the other side, but and then that's quite a bit of empty space on this side, but that's okay. We can see it's because we want it to look realistic. Yeah, realistic. I don't think that's going to make much sense. Now I'm just going to start cutting the leaves and I'm just going to kind of move the paper like that so that I get this little like uneven edges so it'll look like leaves. Um, and now I'm just going to cut off all of the sharp edges and there we go, a leaf. Now you had just have to repeat this until you have enough to make a salad. Um, yeah, so the other side it didn't turn out that good, but it's okay. Okay, so now that I'm done cutting, um, there's still quite a bit of this paper left, so I'm just gonna save it and maybe cut some more later. Now, I feel like one color is a little too boring, so I'm gonna make a lighter or like brighter green, so it can have a little more different leaf or like make it look a little more interesting. Remember that tomatoey colored paper? I'm getting as a whole punch just punch out some circles so it looks like tomatoes in the salads. Do you have tomatoes with your salads? I don't know. Okay, so now the tomatoes are done. Let me just zoom in because you can see um, it's really hard to see like this. Yeah, you see that? Tomatoes. You can also have some like tomato seeds type of things. But I'm just going to make it keep it simple. So now I'm just going to cut out the lighter color leaves because they're dry. Just repeat what you did with the darker color leaves um, on the lighter color one.
So now that we're done with the ingredients, let's start mixing this all together. But before we do that, I'm just gonna crumble off these leaves because they look a little too straight and perfect for leaves. So let's crumble them up. And that's it for the salad. So now remember that surprise fast food? And what we're gonna be making is pizza! So if you love pizza, then come on in. Let's start. Okay, so first thing you're gonna be needing is foam. I didn't have regular foam, so I'm just gonna use glitter foam. It doesn't really matter if you don't have foam. You can use a clay, play-doh, I don't know, anything that will work for pizza will work. So first I'm gonna draw a circle using a pen. Okay, so now I'm gonna cut it out using scissors. And actually gonna use do this off camera because I want a good circle. So the circle came out pretty good. I like it. And now we're gonna paint this. I'm using yellow and orange. They call it scarlet and golden yellow. Um, but I know you can call it whatever you want. And now let's start painting. Okay, so now that's done, let's let this dry. Okay, so while it's drying, remember that tomato recipe thing? So I'm just gonna bring out that paper and my scissors, and I'm just gonna cut off the parts that we used. I'm just, just gonna make it a little easier to whole bunch it out. So we're gonna have pe Play-Doh pepperoni. So before we put on the toppings, we need to put the ketchup on. So I've got some maroon paint for the ketchup. Okay, so now time for the pepperonis. I'm actually gonna do this off camera because I go into good pepperonis. So the pepperonis came out pretty good. I think they look quite like pepperonis. And now I'm just gonna put on the rest of the toppings, which is just some cheese. Do you like cheese? Now I'm just gonna shake off the excess cheese to get it nice and even. Okay, so that's it for this video. I've got paint all over the place. I'm gonna clean up and that and see you in our next video. Bye!